Hi everyone and welcome back. Tonight we're going to do a fairly straightforward dish, very few ingredients, we're going to do the cordon bleu. I'm Rob Stubbs and welcome to my kitchen. So cordon bleu then, some key ingredients, chicken breast, some ham and some cheese. We've got some grueled cheese here and with the chicken breast what we're going to do is butterfly that and flatten it out a little bit, put the ham and cheese in, roll it all up and then we're going to cover it in breadcrumbs. The typical way of covering it in breadcrumbs is we'll dip it in some flour, some egg and then into the breadcrumbs, shallow fry before we put it in the oven for a little while. Let's get stuck in. Okay first off we're going to butterfly these chicken breasts. So let's take the thick end and let's just cut through. Okay, we're going to clean up the board, bit of cling film, cover it with cling film and give it a bash in. Okay, we'll just finish off putting the cling film on, layer on the top, layer on the bottom just gently flatten it out. Try and get it as even as possible because you want to be able to put the ham and the cheese inside and be able to roll it up. That's fairly thin about three to four millimetres really. Spot on. Let's do the next one. Marvellous. Let's get the ham and the cheese. Okay, let's take the top layer of cling film off. Sit that down there, put some ham. Carefully roll it up nice and tight. Nice and tight then. And keep the cling film on to hold it cold and tight. Cling film on and roll it nice and tight. Okay, 
Okay, time to cover our cordon bleu in flour. Breadcrumbs, cut generously with breadcrumbs. And then we're right over to the pan to shallow fry. Just gently brown all of the breadcrumbs before we put it in the oven for 15 minutes. Now into the oven for 15 minutes at 180 degrees. So there you go, called on blur with uh, bechamel sauce and tatty stacks my tatty stacks you can see in another video so watch out for that thanks for watching we'll see you soon